Now I'm going to show you how to use uh, a very useful command that's found in the psych package. Um, in a different tutorial I showed you how to install the psych package. Uh, one of my concerns was do I have to reinstall this package every time I start R? And the answer for me anyway is no. If I go to a cursor here and I go library psych and it's activated. I didn't have to reinstall that package. This is a new uh, instance of R and I was able to reactivate that psych package. So once you install it, uh, you shouldn't have to do that ever again on that particular uh, computer. Now I've already loaded in a data set named ZAR81 and these are the data from problem 8.1 in ZAR. Uh, we've got sex and serum cholesterol and I want some basic descriptive stats but I want them by groups so I want the stats separate for the males and the females and so the psych package has a very neat little command called describe.by and then I open parentheses and I tell it what variable I want to summarize and in this case my dependent variable is called serum and then I tell it what are the groups that I want to split serum into and in this case it's sex close parentheses hit return and look at that for each group I got the females and the males it gives me all the pertinent descriptive stats I've got the sample size now it says var here, that's not variance, that's variable number one. The sample size, six females, and you go up here and you go one, two, three, four, five, six, that's correct. The mean for the females, the standard deviation, it gives me the median. Trimmed, I don't know what that is. Mad, I don't know what that is. The minimum, the maximum, the range. It even gives us skewness and kurtosis, which you'll recall are variables that help describe the shape of the histogram and it gives the standard error. So that's all very important variables. And if you want to read more about for example this command or any command in R, if you just type question mark and then the name of the command, so I'm going to go question mark describe dot by and I can get help on this command. So I hit return and it actually launches my browser. Let me shrink so you can see it. So it's launched Firefox and gone to a page that describes the describe.by command and you see it's telling us that's in the psych package. And so if I wanted to look up what some of these different values are, I could look through here and I could figure it out. Pretty cool.